guys welcome back to my channel it is me Candy Lee Carly and today's video is going to be a first impression style video about the NYX Total Control Drop Foundation so I just got back from Ulta like I came in I sat right down to film this first impressions video because I needed a foundation to film a few videos tonight so I just went out and I grabbed this because you know I've been wanting to try it it was on display hoping it works for the sake of the rest of my videos <laughs> so I don't know I don't know if I got the right color or anything but you know we'll see <laughs> bottle on the front and it says next total control drop foundation and then on the back it says right here to shake well before you use it so let me try to do that and it's giving you a chart of what a light drop of foundation is what a medium drop is and what a full coverage drop of foundation is I think I'm gonna go with light because I never really do full coverage. On the side of the box, oh boy, this is where the claims come in. That with just a few drops, our Total Control Drop Foundation delivers sheer to full coverage and a velvety matte finish. Simply adjust the number of drops you use until the desired level of coverage is achieved. More drops equals more coverage. Okay, let's see about that. So, here I have the foundation. But also, there was a brush that came with it, and I didn't know if I wanted to try it, and I think it was, like, as much as the foundation. I was just like, you know, I don't know. I have brushes. I have a blender. We'll see. But if I need a brush, <laughs> I will go get the brush. But we're going to try it without it. So the bottle basically just says the same things that the box does. Just looking at it, yeah. And it says how long the shelf time is. It says 24 months. But um, about the bottle, I think this bottle seems to be glass. Not really sure. It could be a really cool plastic, but it seems glass to me. I'm not gonna drop it to test it, but that's pretty cool. So the top is like a squeezy little dropper thing. Um, <laughs> and then you have to open it up. Let's see. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So this is what it looks like. Oh, I hope this is my color. Oh, you guys don't even understand. Please be my color. I'm just going to put some on here. Okay. Seems like it's my color, you guys. But we're going to try this foundation out first impressions I'm gonna figure out how to do this um, how do I use this dropper thingy maybe like a regular dropper okay I fills it up I'm gonna drop it on my hand oh it's coming out faster than I thought so I have it on the back of my hand and we're gonna we're gonna see oh my goodness oh my god what no no, I don't really think this is my color. Goodness gracious. My color, Carly. Let's drop it on the face. 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 Okay. Alright. So let's blend. 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 Okay, it's looking like my color, but it's not looking like my color at the same time. I'm not sure how it looks on the camera, but whatever. We're gonna work with it today because this is all I got, and I gotta film some videos today. So, oh well, I think this is the best color I'm gonna get from this line. This is the only one that really looked like my color, but I'm gonna put a few more drops on my face. I'm not really, I don't like <laughs> how this works. I feel like I'm putting the some sort of serum on my face. Something that's gonna make me stay young until I'm 400 years old. <laughs> it's a little much, but I think it's working out. Um, I don't have many marks on my face, so I mean, I'm not sure if it will cover acne and all that stuff so well. I'm not really sure because I don't have it. But I have this coloration around here. So we're going to focus on that area right now and see what it does for me. Drop it. I think I might even end 
dressing and brush you guys because I don't like what's going on here. Okay, it's doing pretty good. I think I just went from a six to a solid nine point five. Oh, oh my goodness! Okay. I'm gonna sew on my forehead. Oh, you guys, this is this is kind of like very fun. Like, I'm not gonna lie, it feels weird, but it's kind of fun. But I still really want the brush. I should have got it today, I just didn't. I didn't know. I didn't know how essential it was. <laughs> I wish I would have watched reviews. Okay, I think I love it. It looks really good on me. Okay, so I think I really like this. It looks really nice on my face. I think I I went kind of medium coverage instead of light. So be careful how you drop this little dropper thing because I did drop it all over my face. <laughs> but once I get better at you know applying it to my face, I think it's gonna look so much better. Mm -hmm. I hope I don't run out of this too fast because it seems to be a really really tiny bottle and I can't look in there and see how much is in there because I feel like this bottle is colored or maybe it's just clear and it's filled all the way up or it's stained I'm not sure but we're gonna see how long this lasts me once I run out of it I will make another video so if it only lasted me a week you should know not to get it because <laughs> I mean I don't use foundation that often so if I run out of it fast but overall, I think this was a pretty good buy. Um, the only thing I would recommend is to get the brush that comes with this because you drop the little droplet <laughs> into the brush and then you blend it onto your face. It's that type of brush. And it looks pretty cool. I just, I just didn't grab it. So I like it. I recommend it, but I recommend it with the brush. <laughs> but I will come back to you guys when I have the rest of my face done return and i have the rest of my makeup on over this foundation and it looks really really nice to me. i actually really love it i think this is one of my favorite foundations ever because usually when i put something else on top of my foundation it can get a little patchy and weird looking like i <laughs> i don't know i usually use the maybelline fit me and i use the anastasia beverly hill stick but like nothing worked with my products as good as this so i'm like when i'm done filming i will come back to you guys and show you how my foundation lasted through filming and watching netflix and stuff like that because filming is stressful to me and sometimes you know my forehead can get a little bit sweaty and stuff we'll see we'll see how it looks so wish me luck i hope this foundation is as great as it looks right now and i'll see you guys soon so I am leaving my room, um, just left my room from filming this video, this first impression for you guys, and I'm going to go in my bathroom because I have some wonderful lighting, and it's going to tell me the truth about this foundation, so we're going to go in here, and we're going to look, and we're going to see how it looks in the awesome lights in the bathroom. camera could pick up like the beauty in the mirror instead of like right here mm -hmm. wow if i look good in this bathroom i look good anywhere because this these lights let me know if i look a mess every day Anyway, <laughs> I'm about to go eat some spaghetti and then I'm going to go film my videos, watch some TV, and then I'm going to see how this lasted. 
So, so I'm sitting here watching Clueless on Netflix and eating my spaghetti. So far, so good. Still looking the same. But I'm about to edit some videos. Well, we'll see how it lasts after that. But that's the first check in, basically. Hey okay, guys, I am back and I'm tired. Filmed some videos. I edited some videos. I ate food. I watched Clueless. I did a lot of stuff. And I forgot that I was doing check ins for this makeup. So. Long story short, I think this foundation is fabulous. It doesn't seem to have changed at all. And it's been like maybe three and a half hours. So with that being said, I think this is a pretty good option if you want a foundation that is nice and full coverage that can also be minimal coverage and is a good price at the drugstore. By the way, this foundation is $13.99 at Ulta, and you can probably get it online too. And for reference, again, I got mine in the color golden. But thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you try out this foundation, and I think I'm going to go to Ulta this weekend and buy one more because, you know, I want to stock up. And they didn't have that many golden shades there, so might be popular <laughs> so i need to go get another one but i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching me and be sure to check out my other videos and subscribe because i have a giveaway coming up soon anyways bye guys